At least a dozen cases of the coronavirus are now connected to one retirement community in the Woodlands, the Conservatory at Alden Bridge. And we have just learned that the Montgomery County judge has now issued a shelter in place for that senior living facility. Channel 2's Hannah McKenzie continues our live team coverage now with more details about this outbreak and this order. Hannah? Dominique, that shelter in place order came down within just the last few minutes and basically it reads no one is allowed to enter or leave the facility unless they're a health care worker or an employee necessary to keep the place running. Now, just five days ago, I'm told from faculty um, spokespeople that two residents had tested positive for coronavirus and today the number has spiked to 12. Now, we don't know if those are all residents or if those are employees as well. Coronavirus cases spiking at the conservatory at Alden Bridge. On Thursday, the facility's Facebook page reporting two residents testing positive. On Friday, seven more. Today, a spokesperson confirming with us the total now stands at 12. It's a scary situation. This woman dropping off food and medication for her 89-year-old father, telling us he hasn't left his room in 12 days. I came up here the other day and he was sitting out on his balcony and we got to wave to each other. Loved ones adapting to a new normal in an effort to protect those most vulnerable to the virus. I'm dropping off some preventative stuff for the Johnsons. Hand sanitizer, masks, gloves. Alex Elgizable stopping by with a care package for his family friends. It concerns them. So they're keeping their distance, staying inside, and practicing social distancing. His friends aren't ill, but Elgizable says they haven't heard from management in days. We reached out. They responded with this statement, saying the most recent individuals who tested positive were asymptomatic and are being quarantined in their rooms. So I wish they would be a little more open. I, I have had to call and ask questions, and they will answer my questions. It's just they don't seem to be forthcoming with information. Now, if residents here want to leave, i.e. they don't want to do that shelter in place, they have until 6 p.m. tomorrow. If they're heading to a friend or family member's house, though, they are told that they must quarantine, self-quarantine while they're there. And if they do leave, they will not be allowed to return here to the conservatory at Alden Bridge until April 13th. Reporting live from the Woodlands, Hannah McKenzie, KPRC Channel 2 News. Thank you, Hannah.